Hello guys, I'm going to introduce you to the violin or fiddle, as I call it a fiddle. This is the instrument here. Um, the violin and the fiddle are the same, just played a little different. I can go over some of the things. This is a chin rest. This is the tailpiece, the fine tuners. And we have the bridge, the strings the fingerboard, the top of the instrument is here, the back, the neck, and the tuners, and the scroll. This is also called the nut, that's where the strings go across. All right, so, what I want to say about this is if you decide to take this instrument on, remember, it's probably the more challenging instrument uh, out of the bluegrass instruments, um, at least at the beginning of your playing. It takes perseverance and uh, dedication. You cannot let yourself get frustrated. At first, it's not going to sound good. That's just the way it is. There's some tool, tools that will help you, um, learning good posture, uh, taking the time to get your intonation right, a good hand position, all these things will help you in, in, with the starting on your fiddle. Some of the things that you will need, shoulder rest, I recommend this highly. A lot of people try to play without them. I can show you an example of why you need this. When you put it on here, you're going to, you cannot hold this instrument up correctly without it. There are some pads they make um, that help, but really the best tool is a shoulder rest. So that goes on to the back of the instrument. They range in price from uh, $12, maybe a little bit more, matters the quality. And then you can hold your instrument up like this, and that gives you the freedom to move your hand in the correct way. If you can see that, all right. So that's really important part of uh, your violin or your fiddle, okay? All right, you also will need a tuner. Um, if you have a piano and you, if you have tuned other instruments by ear, you, you can do it. The, the strings are E, A, D, and G. You also will need a bow. This is a bow. You'll need that, and you will need rosin. I'll pull that out of there in a bit, but anyways, you'll need a, a, a block of rosin. Okay, so that's just kind of something to introduce you to the uh, fiddle or violin, and, and let and let you know that uh, you, it's a challenge when you take it on, you got to take it on in a way that you don't give up. And uh, after you work hard on it, it, then it'll start sounding good. It will not sound good at first. But it's a challenge to get, get your fingers in the right place. We call that intonation. That, that'll be a challenge for you. And just learning to tune the instrument can be a challenge, especially uh, for young folks, so I really suggest that parents help in the tuning process um, and learn how to tune the instrument for their student. Uh, it, it's definitely something that uh, is a team effort. All right, so there you go. There's the fiddle, the violin, whatever you want to call it, for whatever style playing you do.